One of the secrets to a successful football season is to have a deep and productive rotation on the defensive line to allow the coaches to keep guys fresh late into the season. The New York Giants have sought to do that with their defensive line this year, adding draft pick Jordan Riley and veterans Rakeem Nunez Roches and Ashawn Robinson to a group that already includes Dexter Lawrence, Leonard Williams, DJ Davidson, and Ryder Anderson. There is also another guy who's looking to get a piece of the pie, Vernon Butler. Butler is six foot four, 330 pounds, and was originally a first round draft pick by the Panthers in 2016. But thanks in part to injuries and in part due to performance, Butler didn't earn any starts until 2019, his final season with the team. Butler then went on to the Buffalo Bills, where he crossed paths with current Giants general manager Joe Shane and perhaps to a lesser extent, head coach Brian Dable, then the Bills' offensive coordinator. Butler went on to log 10 starts in 24 games as a rotational defensive lineman for the Bills. Last year, he followed Shane and Dable to the Giants, and he saw action in just one game, racking up four tackles and no sacks. Butler is probably best at clogging up interior run lanes. But with that said, Given that the guys that the Giants have on the depth chart at that position, Butler sure does look to have an uphill battle to make the 53-man roster, let alone the practice squad, where youngsters like Riley and perhaps even Davidson might have a better chance of snagging a spot if they don't make the 53-man roster.